What everyone, this is a new unboxing of my new AIO to my PC. It's coming right here. Much love and hope you enjoy. Peace. What everyone, welcome to this video. It's the AG Tech Boy right here coming with another video with, of course, Corsa H150i LCD. It's quiet, it's impressive, and the noise is not that that loud and it's not that annoying when it comes to it. And the fans are all good quality, everything is just good quality. So, um, what do you get? I'll let me look which we get three of the new fans, a free 120 mils. Then you get a uh, commander core and our commander core x or something from the core so you get a control with it to control the AO and pump and lcd and the fans and everything for ourselves so you need to think about buying a control and everything is run all through Corsair iq and that is amazing because today is now it's always going to do pump speed fan speed lcd screen rgb like all oh, it's of course with light um get a fan itself with the lcd screen and don't worry if the lcd screen pops off the arrow don't worry, it's totally fine. That happens. I did multiple times for me, but you just gotta put a bag on. It's pretty simple, pretty easy. It means to do that. But also, the mountain brackets for Intel, AMD, and Threadripper, uh, and AMD and 4 will also fit with M5, so don't worry about that. The Intel is also with the new LG and that one, so it's all generations out there. And of course, the Threadripper, AMD Threadripper. I don't know if it has to Intel Threadripper, but uh, I think it was only to AMD Threadripper. Could also be to Intel too. So. Will probably fit with everything almost and the block itself is actually not that big uh the clearance to the ram no problem there because it's io so all all in one liquid cooler so ram clearance no problem there it is the, the lcd square and screen itself is pretty bright it's pretty amazing the cooler itself and also basically just one thick cable is running through and then there's another cable that runs to the mobile board that is just a decoy to say to the pc that is there's a fan on it so you can turn on so Basically everything is run through the controller and the course IQ pretty amazing. So let me show how it looks right here. So now when course IQ, it's a mode I already have. I have Commander Pro because I have fans in there. But this is what you probably need of course. Of first, before you do anything, you need to update the software. Um you can check it in here if you want to check for updates to the ice and everything. So when you're done that, this is gonna pop up. Uh, you can see when you pull over, I have some stuff that's coming, light effects, cooling, alerts, and device settings. So if you click on it. And say okay the first thing that comes up it's pretty much this but you can extend this so that's different stuff if you want to roll with this is ring itself yes i have nisiko because i fucking love anime adjustment then you can put a solid color if you want to or no effects this is just gonna check for what fans and actually pretty just checking what it's for it's pretty much just checking actually so you don't need to mouse it just checking for you um then you have 
of course the ring itself this is for the all this is for the free fans you can check for the ring but this is also for everything if you want to i have it on here because the weird thing about it if i put it over here it's gonna fuck with my of course iq fan that's from a commander pro and i don't get why it does that but it does it so i just have it here too it doesn't fuck up the other effects and uh, color effects i've set on my other older six no eight fans i know yep uh, five fans i have the older version um because i have a lean lead dynamic old living case so i have literally almost nine fans i have eight fans three of them is on the cooler and five of them is for myself from intake um yep i will lighting then you get the screen set up this is where you can choose you need to do it on both hardware screen and screen of setup so first you need to choose okay which one do i want as you can see i have like fucking all different stuff and yes you can move it if you want to and do everything and also and zoom in zoom out you choose what you want to um i have nisiko i've either this one set to it or this one but ea2 first well yeah said okay i'll wait this you can also put images if you want you can also put images um pretty amazing put images on so if you want to you can add pages that you upload this up okay you'll find some images that we need to be in jvmg you, you don't know how it works you know how it works then it says effects if you want to run effects there's like different effects too because it's at uh, there's a temp there's a sensor inside <clears throat> a pump that will show you what temperature the liquid itself is the cooling so you can choose whatever you want to different settings it's pretty amazing actually pretty cool this is actually the cpu this can show two things it can show the cooler temp but also the cpu package then the black totally turbo mode yes that that's a different also you can show the fucking clock it's actually pretty amazing you can do a lot of different stuff but i've just set it to um imagine and i set it to gifts because that's my style um then you do it in here too where i can also say where i can go default but also you can go gift images yes but you need to save it in here i've already saved in there but you also need to do it in here so save it in here and also have the same exactly here. so building that sensor is probably maybe you into so that's the different presets you choose what you want to do that's quiet that's balance it's like the mode that's already in that quiet balance extreme so up here motor balance speed after the quiet extreme you can also set it to you can hear the pain you can hear the pump noise but it's not that worse grab it I mean, headset you cannot hear at all you mostly have some good headset sound a lot so you don't need to think about that um then you have of course quiet i've said it's a quiet because then when i take it off if i want to sometimes i go on my phone and really quick check something with my headset off then i don't want to have it on it this is my own custom set you can do it you can add your code that's the word if you want to be sure you should use if you want to i don't i just said it i just have made my own io just like it's the fan style also called it that then you can see the cooler temp inside if you want to so you can move it example a lot of different stuff you can also set it to all different sensors. if you really want to set it to in nvidia card or amd card you can also set it to that or some wall board temps you can also set it to that that's like different that's just fixed percent up here it's like this is going for different stuff so you choose what you want to when i'm racing the alerts this one i don't use but it's basically just emergency emergency alert so when this is emergency shutdown that just means this will sense that all this is when it hits seven degrees the cpu or whatever you set the sensor to set all fans 100 percent but also you can set it to trigger all large billets so it will trigger all large billets on io itself you can run a file also and you can also if it hit 85 degrees you can also change that if you want to you can change it if you want to you don't have to i just have it all off but when it's 85 shut down the pc it will automatically shut down the pc itself it's pretty amazing the last one you have is pretty just you can set the frame rate right now it's 30 that's the max the lowest one is one so you can set the screen behind the like find that cd screen is black or white um you can set the brightness to it the brightness itself to the fans that's just the brightness itself then you have the lcd color there's the screen itself you can also set it to the right there so then you can check for updates and so yep so hope you all like this video stay safe and healthy jg tech for us out of here peace much love bye